Hello everyone, in this straight cam video, we're going to look at homologous series. Homologous series is defined as the series of compounds with similar chemical properties and each member differs from the next member by a constant CH2 unit. So the members of the same homologous series, we call them as the homologs. Do you remember that it will be represented by the same general formula? For example, the homologous series of alkane, the general formula would be CnH2n plus 2, alkene C2H2n, and alcohol. This is the example of the general formula. So all of the homologs from alkane will be having the same general formula same goes to all of the homologs in alkene they will be having the same general formula as this one they will have a difference in terms of the number of ch2 units okay and they will show gradual change in the physical properties so some of the homologs in the alkane for example they will be having different boiling points, different solubility, depending on the CH2 units they have. They will have the same functional group, okay? All of the homologs in alkene, they will have carbon-carbon double bond. All of the homologs in alcohol, they will have the functional group of hydroxyl group, okay? And then the fifth point over here, they will have similar chemical properties. Why? Because they have the same functional groups. They, they can have different physical properties, but in terms of chemical properties, it will be the same because the homologs in the same homologous series will have the same functional group. Number six, they can be prepared by similar general methods. So let's have a look at the homologous series. Alkane, they do not have functional group, and this is the general formula. Alkene, the functional group is carbon-carbon double bond, and that is the general formula. And the alka alkyne, the homologous alkyne, they have functional group of carbon-carbon triple bond, and this is the general formula. And for arene or aromatic compound, they have the functional group of benzene ring, and that is the general formula. And then homologous series alcohol, they have the functional group of hydroxyl group. And homologous series of ether, they will have the functional group of alkoxy. This is the general formula. And then homologous series of haloalkane, they will have the functional group of halogen. And homologous series of aldehyde, they have the functional group of carbonyl. Homologous series of ketone, functional group is carbonyl. Homologous series carboxylic acid, functional group is carboxyl group, and that is a general formula. And acyl chloride, Homologous series, acyl chloride, functional group is acyl. Homologous series, ester, the functional group will be carboalkoxy. And homologous series, anhydride, the functional group will be acid anhydride. Homologous series, amide, the functional group will be carboxamide. Nitrile, functional group is cyano group. And then homologous series for amine, the functional group will be amino group. Okay, let's have a look at one example. I'm going to try to take the homologous series of alcohols. And we do know that the functional group for alcohols will be hydroxyl group. And we can have the a different kind of homologs. We can have this homologs over here when you have CH3OH, okay? 
So this is homolog number one. And then you can have CH3, CH2, OH. That is homolog number two. And then we can also have CH3, CH2, CH2, OH. That is another example of homologs. All of these are homologs of the alcohols. They have differences in terms of number of CH2. This one has CH3OH. This one has additional CH2. This one has more CH2 in it and so on. Okay, so all of them are the homologs of the homologous series of alcohols. All of them have the hydroxyl group right over here. They have the same chemical properties, but they have slightly different physical properties due to the number of carbons they have in there. So I hope you would be able to understand what does it mean by homologous series and homologs, and you can differentiate that in comparison with functional groups.